very, very important uh, from all the adults in the room to give you guys all the tools that you need to be incredibly successful in life, right? No matter what it is that you choose to do. And in class, you're learning about things like math and history and science, and all of that is very important. Do you all agree? Yeah. Right, but today I stopped by to say hello and just talk about a word that Mrs. Dale used. It was integrity. Can everybody say it again? Integrity. Integrity is really about knowing the difference between right and wrong, right? And always choosing uh, to do what is right. Does everybody know what it means to have a good reputation? Anybody know what that word means? Okay, do you? No? How about you? Do you know what the word reputation means? Well, sort of, yes. How you act and how you behave, but then how, what people think about you, right? And it's always good to have a good reputation. Does everybody, does everybody agree with me? Yes. Right, and you, you get your reputation based on the things that you do, right? When people watch you, when you're in class or when you're playing sports, so on and so forth. Does that make sense to everybody? Yes. But integrity is really about doing what's right when nobody's watching. Right, so you build your reputation based on what people see you do, right? But if you have a, a, a good sense of integrity, it's about doing what's right when nobody is watching you. Does everybody know what character means? Yeah. Go ahead. Character is like, say I have a good judge of character, that means I'm like a good person. Sure, and, and having good character means that you are a good person too, right? So everybody in this room, the adults, the adults included, me included, every day we have an opportunity to build up our character, right? And it's about we build our character and our reputation based on the decisions that we make, right? Everybody needs that. I think it's very, very important. And another way that you can build your character, right, is by simply helping the person sitting next to you, right? And that's that's part of having integrity as well. When you see you see your classmate or you see somebody else maybe having a bad day or falling on some hard times, it's important that you do what you can do to be helpful. Go ahead. Right, bullying is bad. Does everybody agree with that? Yeah. Right, so listen, that's a really good point. If somebody sees somebody being bullied, you should step up, right, and help that person who's being bullied. But most importantly, you should, you should let your teacher know about that, right? So we can, put an end, we can put an end to that. Does that make sense? So all of these things that I talked to you about very briefly today really will help you become successful, right, in life, right? To be successful in life, you have to have good character, right? You have to have a good reputation. And you have to have what? Integrity. Say it loud. Integrity. Right, doing the right thing when nobody's watching. Remember that, okay? And I'll just, I'll, let me say this before I get to your questions. Uh, it's very important. Success, everybody's working here to give you the opportunities that you need to be successful. But even though you're all very young in this room, much younger than I, even much younger than Benji who's with me, uh, it's really important that you do two things in life to be successful. You work hard and you dream big. Does everybody know what I mean by that? Yeah. Right, you guys can accomplish whatever it is you want in life. It doesn't matter, right? Dreaming is free. And I promise all of you, it doesn't matter where you live, what kind of shoes you wear, what kind of PJs you wear to school, just work hard and dream as, as, as big as you possibly can and you'll be successful, okay? All right, say integrity very loud. Hey. I love it. That was great. So we have a couple of questions. To your, to your question about why is it important for, for political people to have integrity, uh, it's because the, the adults in the room, when, when they go and they vote for you, they put uh, a great deal of trust in the decisions that you'll make on their behalf, right? So part of, part of me being in this position and, and me working on my character and my reputation, you heard me say being open and accessible earlier, right? Uh, it's very, very important as part of my reputation and character for, to, be, to be open and accessible to, to the adults in the room, right? Because I can't just go to Albany and make my own decisions, right? That's not, that's not good. That's not having integrity. Having integrity means listening to the adults in the room, right? Listening to the needs of the community. And then when nobody's watching me from home, when I go to Albany, uh, and make, I, I need to make the right decisions. But integrity 
is very, very important for everyone, regardless of what the job that, that you may be doing. And unfortunately, uh, the, the realities are that sometimes politicians don't have integrity, right? And what happens when you break the public's trust or you lack integrity? You know what happens? The police come to get you. And you get in trouble, right? And nobody, nobody, nobody wants that. Uh, so I promise all of you in this room, right, as long as you, you guys are going to continue to work on your character, right, continue to work on your reputation and have as much integrity as you possibly can. And you know what? I am much, much older than you, and I'm going to continue to do the same thing, okay? All right. All right. Thank you. What do we say? So.